In this video, I'm going to talk about radians and degrees and how it relates to circles. And you can learn more at mybooksucks.com. I think everyone's seen the old XY plot. And let's imagine we have a circle and we want to know the distance of that yellow, come on, there you go, that yellow dot or that yellow line. Arc length is equal to radians times radius. It's just a formula. And now you're probably wondering, what is a radian? But before I tell you about radians, I've got to tell you about circumferences of circles. So let's say the circumference of the circle is this dot that goes all the way around, or this yellow line. Come on, you can do it. There you go. The circumference is 2 pi r. And that's just a standard formula. Radians is equal to the degrees divided by 180 times pi, and again that equals radians. It's just a review, a quarter of a circle is 90 degrees, right there, about 90 degrees, if I get that to work, there it is, 90 degrees. Half a circle is 180 degrees, so that's the top half, half is 180 degrees. So using the formula from above, 180 degrees is equal to pi radians, or 1 pi radians. Now a whole circle or is 360 degrees, so it is equal to 2 pi radians, twice as much as 180, right? You may have to watch this video more than once, by the way. So the top part of the, the circle is 180 degrees. And the arc length is equal to radians times the radius. So let's say the radius is r. The arc length we say is s. Radians is 2 pi r. So the arc length is s is equal to pi r. Finally, get over there, man. Now in this case, radius is equal to 6 units. So it's s is equal to pi 6, or we would write it as 6 pi. So the radius of the whole circle is going to be s, which is the arc length again, is equal to 2 pi times r. And remember what this is, that's just the circumference of a circle. That's just the formula for that. So now we have s is the arc length is equal to 2 pi. We know the radius is 6, put that over there. And 2 times 6 is 12 pi. So it's the circumference is equal to 12 pi. Finally, we're getting back to our original question, which is the arc length of that yellow line at 60 degrees. We know that arc length is equal to radians times radius, or s. So arc length is equal to radians times radius, which is 6. So the radians is degrees divided by 180 pi is equal to radians. In our case, we have 60 degrees divided by 180, which is 1 divided by 3 when we simplify it. So it's 1 third pi times the radius, which is 6, which is 2 pi. So we know that the arc length is equal to, come on, s is equal to 2 pi. And that's how we'd say the distance of that part of the circle. You'll probably want to watch this more than once. That's just an introduction to circles, so good luck and have fun.